Hi, this is Pastor Randy. I think that many of us were happy to see 2020 in our rearview mirror. It was certainly a year with plenty of challenges, but if we imagined that things were going to change simply because we turned the page on a calendar, I'm afraid that we were very mistaken. At our house, we started New Year's Day with an ice storm that dropped tree limbs all over my yard. A friend called it destruction caused by beauty. It also led to a power outage that lasted for eight hours. On the second day of 2021, we decided to cancel church because of the ice-covered parking lot. And I woke today on the third day of 2021 with the realization that our furnace was not working. Several months ago, I had marked a page in a book that I was reading that talked about the good that God can bring from our troubles. I thought I would do one of those encouraging videos someday about it, but instead I chose to make it the topic of my sermon today. It's a sermon that is only available online due to the ice storm, and I called it, What Good Comes From Suffering. It uses Paul's words to the Corinthian church in 2 Corinthians chapter 1. God comforts us in all of our troubles so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. We were under great pressure, he said, so that we despaired of life itself. But this happened that we might not rely on ourselves, but on God. That's the message I want to share with you today. Are you having a rough time? Let it be a reminder to rely on God. My devotion this morning uses the words of 1 John chapter 4, verse 16. We have known and believe the love God has for us. Recognize that whatever you're going through passes through the filter of God's love for you. Know and believe that love. Trust that God can work good in whatever it is that you're going through. And if God has gotten you through some tough times, remember that part of the purpose in that is so that you can help others go through their tough times, to comfort them and encourage them as you have been comforted and encouraged yourself. Jesus did not promise that we wouldn't have tough times. In fact, he said in John 16, in this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. And when we rely on him, we become overcomers too. Until next time, this is Pastor Randy. Be safe, love one another, and trust in God.